In this video, you will learn about setting up the two computers included with Victoria. By the end of the video, you should be ready to set up and plug in the bedside monitor, assemble the tablet accessories, and establish communication between the tablet and the monitor software. Carefully unpack the bedside monitor and place it next to Victoria on a flat, stable surface. Plug the power cable into the port on the bottom of the access panel. Plug the adapter for the wireless keyboard into any of the open USB slots. And lastly, plug in the wireless router to any of the open USB slots. Press the power button and wait for the computer to start. Once the bedside monitor is on, double click the Gamard monitors icon. The monitor program will open, but no vitals will display until Uni is opened and communication is established between the programs. The box with the tablet includes a type cover and a protective case. There is a magnetic receptacle for the type cover on the bottom side of the tablet. Once the type cover is on, fit the case on the back of the tablet. Gently press the corners and the borders of the tablet to snap it into the case. The RF module has an adhesive strip. Remove the strip and adhere it to the back of the tablet case. The streaming audio headset plugs into the upper corner of the left side of the tablet. The stylus, when not in use, is held in place by the holder on the left side of the tablet. Press the power button in the left corner of the upper side of the tablet to turn it on. Once the tablet is on, use the tracking pad or touch the screen to double click the Uni icon. The simulator menu allows you to choose from all the simulators programmed to this tablet. Click the name Victoria, and if the serial number does not match the Victoria in use, click the drop down menu and select the proper one. After the correct serial number is displayed in the software, click start to open the interface. The software will automatically connect to the simulator with the matching serial number. The strength of the connection is displayed in the lower left corner of the screen. The battery level is displayed next to the strength of the connection. Victoria can be operated on battery power for approximately 10 hours depending on the number of features used. When both computers are on, connecting to the same network and running the software, the vitals on the bedside monitor will update in real time with the vitals on the tablet.